Keeping your home clean when you're a pet owner can be a little bit daunting sometimes, especially if they're shedding hair everywhere and messing the place up. But not only you want your home to look nice, but you want it to be a safe environment. So it is quite important, isn't it, to, to keep it clean for your pets and for you. Exactly. So the first thing to remember is treat monthly um, for fleas and ticks with frontline spot on for continuous all year round protection. Um, also vacuum um, your home regularly and wash your pet's bedding at 60 degrees on a regular basis to make sure you reduce the amount of mm. eggs, larvae and cocoons in your house. Now, Maggie, for some reason, likes to take her food out of the bowl, put it on the floor. So what do you do if you've got a messy eater in the house? So there's a few things that you can do. You could get a little doggy bib um, or you can get um, a little placemat. So there's one here. Um, basically, that will be under her bowl. So when she's making that mess, it's not going on your nice floors. It's going on the mat, which you can then wipe clean. The other thing my dog likes to do uh, when she goes out into the garden, particularly if it's raining for some reason, is have a good old dig. Mm -hmm. So she comes in not just wet, but with very muddy paws. So what's the best way to get her cleaned up? Okay, so bear in mind Maggie's not going to stay still for long. So there are super absorbent microfiber towels out there. So they're going to absorb much quicker than your average towel. So dry her with that. And you can also get her to stand on one of these um, drip mats um, to make sure that anything that drips off doesn't go on your floor. Now, I'm intrigued why you've got a nail file here. Um, quite a few pet owners, um, if they've got wooden floors, are worried about their pets scratching the floors and damaging them. You can cut the nails. Um, you can either get yourself or your vet to do that. But it's not normally a nice experience for, for the pet mm. or the owner. So if you have a nail file like this, you can then buffer and file the nails down so you're not going to get damaged floors. And we've got pink for girls and blue for boys. Yes, perfect. perfect. Now, of course, we can do all these things, keep our homes clean, protect our pets from fleas and ticks. But what about your friends if they come to mm -hmm. your house with their pet? OK, so it will be an awkward conversation, but it's a really good idea to just check with your friend beforehand. Have they treated their pet before they come to your, to your home? Because you don't want to have gone to all the effort of, of doing all the things you need to do and then for, to have an untreated animal in your house. So lots of great tips there to keep your home clean, to keep your pets protected from fleas and ticks. Uh, all the information will be on our website. That's uk.frontline.com. I'm off to give uh, Maggie a manicure now. <laughs>